Hello, my subscribers, and hello, others who are watching this. It's David Hoffman, filmmaker, with another clip from 1979. Now, this is a clip that a million and a half of you have already seen a version of. Wall Street, people just answering one-word questions. I've changed it, I've added to it, and I want to tell you a bit about it. So, Wall Street at that time, first of all, let's think about what I'm doing. I'm doing the information age, the coming of the information age. Of course, you go to Wall Street. Wall Street's where it's happening. Wall Street where computers are beginning to trade in 1979, where people are savvy, you'd think. Some of them are and some of them aren't. But the camera on the street is still new. Although I did my first Man on the Street in 1964, you can see that film on my YouTube channel, Man on the Street was still thrillingly new in 1979. People were not worried about copyright protection, about privacy. They really were more curious and they wanted to appear on television. I'm interested in how they looked, the clothing. Notice how well-dressed people were and how well they spoke. This wasn't just any part of America, of course, it's Wall Street. But take a listen to the last guy because the last guy answers more than one word. Most people are answering one word because that's what I asked of them. Why did I ask for one word? because we were building a montage, it's at the opening of the film, where people just go one word, what do they think of the information age, what do they think of computers, what do they think of government. But every once in a while I was smart enough, thank God, to let someone ramble. So you'll hear a bit more. What do you do? What's your job? I'm a fixed income salesman. What do you feel about your job? It's good, there's a lot of opportunity there. I think the working class does. There's a lot that they can do. They can organize themselves. What is the word, what is the phrase information society mean to you? Way of organization, way of determining things, way that the American people are. You mean like IBM? I think they have a lot of power. Yeah. Who has a lot of power? IBM. What do you think about your job? Sometimes I like it, sometimes it's exciting, sometimes it's frustrating. Why is it frustrating? Why is it frustrating? Because I can't do what I want to do. Because... Who does? I don't know if anybody does. Slate. Bureaucracy. Um, well. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm a little shaky. Your job. My job? Uh, it's a living. <laughs> Privacy. Um, loneliness. <laughs> Holy! Very good. Very good. First thing that comes to your head. Remember, you're going to repeat exactly what uh, I asked you, okay? Um, okay. Computer. Programming. I'm going to repeat the word. Computer programming. Uh, computer tape. <laughs> computer tape. <laughs> you're rock. Uh, Bureaucracy, Washington. <laughs> uh, bureaucracy, red tape. We're not married. Think, no, you guys are doing great. Really. Oh, yeah. Who do you think has the power right now in society? Who do I think has the power in society? Right. The rich. Why so? Why? Uh, they have so much influence over with the laws. Uh, regulations that they impose upon us. Do you have a lot of paperwork? Do I have a lot of paperwork? Yes. Do I have a lot of work paperwork? Yeah. Yes, I do. What do you think of the corporations? They're devious. <laughs> what do you think about the information society? Pull it close together, guys. 
What do I think about the information side? I think in a lot of respects it's good. It's, uh, um, but then like uh, what we were discussing before with privacy, the laws of privacy, there's probably none whatsoever, which is an invasion of that. And uh, that's not so good either, right? It's good and bad in both, I think. Okay, we're going to do one-liners, right? Okay. Computer. Computer? Do you want to uh, know what, what do you want to... What's the first thing that comes into your head? Computer. Computer, that's what we're working on now. Getting it to operate in the bank. One line. Oh, just one word. Putting it up. Bureaucracy. What is bureaucracy about? No waste on me. Bureaucracy. Well, there's too much bureaucracy going on today. Your job. Well, my job is fine. Computer. Computer has done a wonderful job. The corporations. The corporations had their own problems today with the inflation and and the unions. Say a word. If you can answer with that word, you tell me the first thing that comes into your mind. Okay. okay. Computer. Um. Numbers. <laughs> Bureaucracy. Taxes. You can repeat the word. Let's do it again. Okay. I'll, I'll say bureaucracy. You say bureaucracy. Okay. 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 Computer. Computer numbers. Bureaucracy. Bureaucracy taxes. Privacy. Privacy. Um. Alone. I don't know. Instant communication. Instant communication. Um. Best. McGovern. What? McGovern. McGovern? The government. Oh, the government. Um, Washington. The corporations. Business. Your job. My job? Typing, I don't know. <laughs> Who do you think has the power in today's society? Mostly Congress. Repeat what I say. Uh -huh. I say sunshine, say sunshine. Uh-huh. Um, computer. Computer. Uh, you, I'm not really understanding, so you better just cancel it. Privacy. Privacy? Wonderful. Roll out. No, I'm that was a guy with a hat. No, nope, not a roll out? Yeah, okay. Corporation. Corporation. Uh, I really blank. Government? A little too big, I'd say. Need better need better leadership. Computer. Programming. Bureaucracy. Government. Good job. Fun. Government. Bureaucracy. Slate. Thank you. Who do you think has the power in our, in our society? Government. Why? Tell me, tell me why you think that. I thought this was only supposed to be one word. Um, <laughs> one, sentence. one sentence. Why do I think government has the power? Alright. What was that? Well, because, because it controls the bureau bureaucracy. I mean, that is the, the bureaucracy controls the country. Let's put it that way. Confusion. If you could Too much. The, if you could. The corporations. Corporations? Uh, information. Society. Information. Society. Well, what do you think about that? Tell me about the information. I think we're an information oriented society. So I read the paper that, that uh, the chairman of some company said that we're at an OD on information. What do you think about that? Think it's good or bad or? I think it can't be helped with the telecommunications that's uh, that's expanding as rapidly as it is. You just can't get away from it. Who has the power in our society? The me. Just a second. 
Who has the power in society right now? The government. Why so? Because there's so much confusion that only the government lawyers can interpret what it is. What do you think has the power in society today? What? What? what I don't understand. Now, what power. nationality? Who's the power? Who has the power? The power. Oh, not the people. Uh, the I say the government. Take a look at that. Look at his answer. Did, Tommy, you, did right? you repeat that I was and say about power? You just oh, the power, other government. Not even the other day. I was just walking past the Abasco building. How you doing? Good. It's the answer. communication. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Television. Thank you. You're welcome. Computer. IBM. If you could repeat the word. Oh. Computer. Bureaucracy. I didn't hear Bureaucracy. you. Bureaucracy. Bureaucracy. Uh, politics. Instant communication. Instant communication. Telephone. Government. Corporations. Do I think the government has more power than corporations? If you had asked me that question a few years ago, I would have said no, but today I would say definitely yes. How do you feel about your job? How do I feel about my job? Well, if it paid a little more, I think I'd like it better. How do you feel about being a member of the information age? Well, until I walked... How do I feel about being uh, a member, a of, the member of the information society? That's a difficult question because I didn't know we were in the information society. Uh, by information society, I presume you mean computers and so forth. Uh, I think it's terrific. Without it, we wouldn't be uh, nearly what we are today. It gives us the opportunity to grow both uh, as human beings and uh, scientifically to make advancements we wouldn't have made otherwise. What, do you, what is your job? I, my job is I'm a partner in an investment advisory firm in Wall Street, and I uh, manage accounts. Can you get as much information as you need when you need it? The question is, can I get as much information as I need when I need it? Generally speaking, yes. Most corporations, uh, either voluntarily or legally today, are required to give just about every little detail of their operations. So the answer would be yes. Are you an optimistic about the future? Oh, am I optimistic about the future? I jumped ahead of myself there. Yes, extremely so. We have some problems that, uh, especially with the oil situation, that I think will be overcome. Uh, the problem, I think, is uh, in Washington, they're just you can put a man on the moon and yet you can't come up with a synthetic fuel. I don't agree with that conclusion. I think we will overcome it as the people rally around the old American tradition and come and do their job. Great. Slate.